there are thrillers which are predictable and then there are predictable thrillers that absolutely sweep you from your seat hi guys this is farad and welcome back to my channel popcorn reviews if you're new to this channel then please smash that subscribe button now and remember to like and comment on this video as a video ritual you know liking and commenting helps fuel the youtube algorithm with that let's get back to our review and today the new malayalam film that we're going to be talking about is golem which is now streaming on amazon prime now golem is essentially a who done it that revolves around an investigation that takes place following the death of a personnel in the office premises that is there and then what happens and how the investigation unfolds is what forms the rest of the film but the film here is absolutely riveting with the kind of uh, detailing that it has to offer it starts off as a regular who done it and the regular who done it is good act in the in the purest sense when uh, there is a guessing game that is going on but here there is not necessarily a guessing game that is going on owing to characters there are too many characters here and owing to characters who do not you know you do not know anything about them basically but the swap thing is the shortcoming of this flaw is actually taken over by uh, some wonderful writing that actually in makes you invest in the drama with the uh, who done it elements that are there you are invested in the uh, investigation that had happens in the first star wherein uh, there's a little setup that is there before the first conflict of the murder is introduced after which the investigation begins in the second act you know you slowly get to know that this is a medical thriller but one uh, you know bummer that was there in the screenplay was that the entire picture gets clearer by the end of the second act itself which means there's an entire act that is remaining you know wherein you the cat is already out of the bag you know what the suspense is and only uh, thing that is remaining to see is how it happened this you know trajectory i remember uh, watching it and reviewing it on this channel itself in the malayalam film ibrahim osgler where i was absolutely absolutely not in favor of the filmmakers you know spoon feeding the viewers as to how the things happened which eventually was a part of the third act as well in that film and while that film did not work this film works beautifully in the third act owing to some superb direction that is there there is such detailing that is there you know to the t as to how the entire episode did unfold without you know sticking out like a sore thumb you know it's almost like on point you know with the mood of the drama that is there with the intrinsic planning that takes place you know uh, and ultimately leading to how the crime was committed i think it was wonderful wonderful to witness and i think if this if i was watching this in a theater uh, i would have actually you know clapped and i would have applauded it because it was that good it reminded me of Uh, the feeling the high that i had got while watching um, drishyam that is the, the hindi drishyam remember the malayalam drishyam i had watched much later on and that was the time when there was no ott in 2015 and i had watched the hindi film drishyam and i was absolutely blown away by that uh, in a packed theater and they were all applauding similar kind of a feeling i know i was just breaking into a smile while applauding the filmmakers that was there the writing that was there and i absolutely happened to you know enjoy that third act here um you can say there are a few flaws or loopholes but keeping that aside i think the direction shown here it was wonderful here uh i was a little on the fence though with the uh, the precursor you know like the sequel that was being set up now at this point i don't know whether this is the right decision or the wrong decision time will tell but uh, you know taking nothing away from the screenplay which was very well written here coming to the technical uh, aspects of the film like dialogues music and uh, the direction i felt the dialogues were adequate but uh, they went well with the mood of the drama they were conversational and they revealed a lot of detailing that was there the bgm i felt you know could have been a little better with the theme that are there you know like there could be a central theme you know which is placed followed by a little rendition for each character uh, with their motivations that are there i think that would have been a little experiment that could have been applied here cinematography is also decent here although you can make out that this this the production design is quite low here 
uh, the frames are decent here i wouldn't say they're exceptional um, so likewise for the editing the editing is uh, pretty good here i really liked how the tension was maintained uh, in the screenplay without any um, deviations or digressions that are there director samjad i think he did a smashing job here i think this is his debut vehicle directorial debut and he absolutely knows how to unfold and construct a thriller that is there and the third act that was there which was supposed to be a big flaw turned out to be the boon for me you know boon of the film you know where the detailing that is there that shown in the direction that was there the clarity of thought was exactly there by the director and that really shown and i think he did a splendid job in that third act performances all performances managed to shine i did feel though that uh, the lead ranjit Uh, Ranjit Sajeev I think he could have you know uh, worked a little on his expressions that are there he looked a little too stoic for me and after a point you know the one dimensional uh, trait of the character just seemed to be a little uh, stretched i would say and uh, so he can do a little better with the expressions in his next outing that is there but other than that all of them do a wonderful job i think the veterans that are there alan sir sir or whether it's dilish pothan or it's siddiqui all of them managed to do a smashing job and all the newcomers that are there you know all of them you know right from sanjay to karthik to uh, some of the others that are there all of them managed to shine and do a wonderful wonderful job overall i felt goram is a riveting thriller it's a riveting thriller and it has a sinister plot and it makes for a wonderful wonderful watch and it is streaming on amazon prime let me know what you think after watching it or if you watched it let me know in the comments on what you made of it Also, if there are any recommendations, let me know. If there are some, also uh, like the video. What's more, you can do is share this video with your friends and family. Ask them to subscribe to the channel. I have also, you know, put up a detailed review of Golem on Golem on my site. Um, popcorn reviews with a double S. The link of which is in the description box below. Do visit that. Also, you know. uh visit uh, my social media handles i have freshly also created a social media handle for my popcorn reviews page and i need your support on that the link of that is also in the description box below do visit that i do not end up making a video on everything that i watch but i do write a lot all information is present on my site and on my social media handles so make sure you follow there also on facebook instagram twitter and letterboxd I'll see you again soon with another video till then take care of yourselves and thank you so much for your love and support cheers